In the month of Nisan, in Artaxerxes' 20th year as king, after some wine was brought for the king, I picked up the cup of wine and gave it to the king. I'd never been sad in his presence before. The king asked me, why do you look so sad? You aren't sick, are you? You must be troubled about something. I was really afraid. Artaxerxes, he's the king of Persia. And Persia is a society that, uh, well, human life is really cheap. And uh, the king is seen as, as being like a deity. If he sees something he doesn't like, he can just make it change. Even if that means removing someone, even to the point of death. With that in mind, you can understand why Nehemiah might be afraid. And the king starts asking him direct questions. This is a, this is a high pressure moment. This is a situa situation where I think any of us would be afraid. I was diagnosed with an incurable disease called Crohn's disease. There were definitely fears when I was going into the mission field that, you know, am I going to be okay? Am I going to come back alive? Am, am I going to have, you know, something inside me rupture and have gangrene and die out here in the bush? Um, definitely fears always haunting me, but there's always been this presence of God that has said, I'm going to take care of you. No fear exists where His love is. Rather, perfect love gets rid of fear because fear involves punishment. The person who lives in fear doesn't have perfect love. Now that's just the black ink on the page. What does that really mean to, to me when I'm in a situation where I'm feeling afraid? It usually comes from this sense that I need to protect myself. I need to look after my rights. I need to make sure that I'm looked after. I need to make sure that this bad thing doesn't happen to me. I believe that the message of the cross is to give my life away. And if I can somehow mysteriously rely on the love of God rather than my own sense of fear, then I will be free to move ahead. I'll be free to make uh, the right choice and hopefully be used powerfully by God.